I guess what I could do is two bow towers and just a fence. Those, those should probably be good enough. What do I need for a fence? Eh, space would get better. Oh, I bet things expand out based on me building stuff. Just like in, uh... Like, say, Command and Conquer and whatnot. Well, would I want to go for a stone wall instead? My holy golem has kind of mediocre. Well, gate. So yeah, do we? It cost me a pretty stone. Almost. My, st my other stupid holy golem is just like, hmm, combat, you say? I can't be asked. I have no idea if there's any way to control them. Question. Can I upgrade this instead? Uh, increases storage, increases range. What's the current damage on a... on one of these? Might be worth it. And we're definitely getting, like, resources off of the critters. Uh, I'll put one person on trash. And yeah, we got a dog, so we should probably get a doggo house. Uh, let's see, housing. Doggo house! I'll put it over here. Dog lives next to the landfill. Eh! That's how I pick up more essence. Well, more industry golems. I'll just let them do things. Uh, I'm gonna run out of builders this way. Cause yeah, I have just I have too many immediate buildings to have to work work around. Okay, so I guess next order of business would be just upgrading what I've got. Oh, let's turn off the mini map. Uh, yeah, let's just go high quality housing. Something will have to attract more people to my town. Either that or high-quality housing will convince my people to bone harder. I... both are entirely possible. Now it does look like the makeshift bow tower does not actually need to be manned. So yeah, why don't we let me summon two more labor golems, and then I'm gonna look into walling things off. So let's do defense. Oh, defense golem. Okay, that's for later. Extracts nearby dropped resources and items and teleports them to the tower. Where's an essence collector to run? Yeah, so that's... That's a later thing. Let's see, so do we want to do stone wall? I got a lot of rocks. It'll probably be kind of expensive, but I think we'll need it. And we'll just get a couple more of these arrow towers going. Unfortunately, they're going to be working on the houses. Let's see. Looks like Twitch is bugging out, letting you guys unlock emotes. Unfortunately, I don't have an easy solution to that, so hopefully it'll just, uh... Hopefully it'll just get improved for tomorrow. Uh, oh, that's, that's my labor golem. Okay. Just... 
I'm gonna summon a Holy Golem to hopefully defend. Unfortunately, it's not working so hot. I wonder's on a roll with Colony Sims. They're good games, and also, th I don't know, this has been on my to-do list for a while. We're just gonna go until I get wrecked. And we'll s apparently you can level up and, like, get better perks and some other things. We're, we're gonna see what that results in. Okay, let's go back to walls. Oh. I can't actually put that there. Bleh. Okay, so I'm gonna just get another... Oh, that's a Ballista Tower. Which costs... I mean, we're actually getting kind of close to being able to make that stuff. But yeah, let's... Let's just have this northern wall. And I'm probably going to expand somewhat down this direction for resources. I mean, it's gonna... Our biggest limiting factor is just people. More than anything else. Okay, and we seem to be maintaining our, our stone supply, no problem. So in that case, let's go back to the makeshift bo boyer. Uh... There we go. Let's just have it go up to storage. Mating. Did you notice that Elena Mohan found a new mate? Bronox23 Mohan. Either of them have a home. They may try to go home and make a baby. They'll visit each other often to boost their mood. Try to live in the same house whenever possible. Well, I mean, that's what I got. I got houses. I'm working on upgrading, upgrading them further. We were, we were really strapped for people. It was like, yeah, nomads show up every day. And I'm like, yeah, no nomads. It's RimWorld all over again. People, people allocation and just crossing your fingers that you're not, like, over, overstocked. Uh, let's see. Let's increase the priority of this one. Yeah, put this one on the bottom. I want to get this one done first. Since they tend to come from this direction. Unfortunately, these walls... What are the... What's the priority on the walls? I don't know. I'm going to put this tower on top first. So we can make the rest. Because, yeah, high-quality housing, sooner than later, will be nice, but isn't super important. Wonder how do I make babby? Rock, add meatses, more wood. How how do craft babe? How do craft babby? Let's see. Yeah, un unfortunately, it really does kind of become a bit of a waiting game. We're lucky to be sitting. Oh, no production set. God damn it! I wasn't even paying attention. Oh, they'll go back to making that. Oh. Wow, their child died during childbirth. That's traumatic to just have such a real shame be the only thing that pops up there. That's horrifying. See, so Wander just summon people. I can summon labor golems. Unfortunately, they don't have that much HP, but they'll just power around, just, like, gathering resources for me, which is helpful. Okay, so no energy, definitely no money. Data views? Oh boy. Population list. Oh, they level up by doing tasks. Like working, fighting, and even mating. Oh, sweet. Freaking made a baby, leveled up. That's weird. Okay, so...
Everything is strange. I do have a person working in the Fletcher, right? Should. I should have somebody working in the Fletcher. It's whoever this guy is. Oh, wait. It's... Okay, it's this guy. What is he doing? Oh, nope, he's just delivering. Okay, there's the answer. Okay, so we got some nomads. Uh, do we... Okay, it's these people. Uh, that's actually a lot, too. That's like five people? Nice. So, we might want to make some more housing. I'll make at least one more just regular house. That's a lot of ladies and one dude. Well then. But yeah, we got new peoples. And we have just enough... We have just enough housing for all of them. Can I upgrade high quality housing further. I can. It's expensive, but it's actually not that expensive. So, yeah, next order of business would be upgrade all of my, my makeshift housing into high quality housing, and then probably just keep buffing it. Let's see, this is an isekai? Wait, it is? What? Really? It wouldn't honestly surprise me if it was. Either that or I missed a reference to something that I just said. Both are entirely valid. Uh, let's see. Stone walls. Oh. One dude, four girls. This is... Yeah, I mean, that's a good point. That is very much like isekai gender distributions. Which is weird and uncomfortable, and I don't actually like that that much. Like, I, don't, I don't know how many of you guys read isekai novels or manga or watch watch the animes but it's it's just always super weird uh, let's see let's pop two of them in there i don't think i need more carpenters pop them into lumberjacks and miners and stuff uh do i want that actually we're actually doing fine on both so let's just go all in on builders for the time being. I read too much isekai manga. My problem is just like, there were a couple in the very beginning that were very good. And every once in a while there's like one or two that are really good. And then otherwise it's just kind of like... A lot of nothing. A lot of just like, wish fulfillment of like, I died, went to another world, now I'm going to live a really slow, boring life because... My previous life was unfulfilling because I was a corporate slave, and it's just like, ugh. Oh, we should probably put this back on top. Now that I think about it. There are some really good ones, or some really interesting ones, but otherwise it's just a lot of, like, harem trash, and it's just like, eh. Oh. God damn it. Um... Can my people starve? How do I unharvest something? Because I need them to mine this sooner than later. Because unfortunately, my. Oh, wait, no. I have a spell for this. Uh, let's see. Switch from this. We want to just do... Not regenerate. Not charm. Mend would actually be useful. Conjure material. Okay, so we want to do recall. There we go. Problem solved. I was wondering about that. And it's like, wait. How do I... How do I get them back? But no, they actually thought of, thought of that already. Okay. Anything else? Mostly just slow going and getting everything built. I have a lot of builders that are kind of doing stuff. Uh, let's see. Dismantle those. I'll have two gates. Uh, something's going on here. Corruption! 
You've probably already discovered your villagers are not the only ones in this region. As time passes, corruption will slowly spread and take over the map. And will get threatened if you try and push it back too far. Increasing monster spawn rates and generally causing trouble. Your villager's corruption resistance will prevent the corruption from spreading. And even sometimes push it back. But if you're greedy and try and claim all the land to yourself, you're going to be in big trouble. Okay, I'm going to let them get this last one. Undone, then we'll get a, another wall down. Or another gate down. Oh, I'd, oh, these gates count as ancillary. I didn't realize that. Okay, so we'll only have one then. In that immediate area. Okay, so they got that done. So let's let's put the uh let's put those walls back there. We've got we've got some towers, so this should be less dangerous for me overall. So, evil stuff stay away. A lot of corruption there. Unfortunately, the corruption's kind of in an awkward spot for me. I wonder how you expand to other regions. Because, yeah, I'm not... A... <sighs> this is what I get for picking an area that's mostly just uh, water. Because I'm actually super trapped here. And only have, like, a certain number of places that I can even go for resources. Well, I guess first and foremost, let's just upgrade the village center further. And let's look into some other interesting things. We've got refining storage... Uh, let's see. Refined materials. Okay, board stone, crystal... crystal lithium. Yeah, so it's just telling me about that. So, we probably want to get a stone cuttery down. First and foremost. Also, we should probably upgrade a number of these houses. This is going to keep them busy for a while. Can you make the peninsula into a port city, maybe? I haven't seen anything for boats yet. It's possible? I'm going to plonk a smithy down. So this is absolute bottom. Yeah, no available cut stone. Gonna be working on that. Okay, monsters seem restless. Well, my defenses are better now. My people seem incapable of finishing these things. Not in range. Oh. Oh, we've got another doggo. Okay, I can have up to six dogs before I'm going to need to make more. I don't want to make a makeshift farm all the way out here. I don't really see the immediate need. Is there anything I can do with these wild dogs? Antlers. Wow, there's actually a fair bit of stats just with that. Good to know. Magic. No, that's crystal motivators. Refinery storage. Do I need somebody to work on this? The answer doesn't look like it. Oh, kitchen. Kitchen seems like something I should probably work work on. If I can find out where a kitchen is. Civics, maybe? We might also want a maintenance building. Though... Currently, stuff got fixed anyway, so maybe it's not that necessary. I guess it would be under food and water, wouldn't it be? Or wouldn't it? Oh, yeah, there's even more here. So, outposts. Kitchen. Does require stone cuttery before I can actually do this. So in that case, let's get an animal pen down first. I don't know. I guess I'll just jam it right there. Okay, so that does mean we're going to need a ranger station.
from the ranger's station. Is the ranger's station the same as the ranger's lodge? Or is the ranger's station the outpost? I'm going to assume... Ranger's Lodge is what we're looking for. Okay, so we're going to want one stone cutter, and let's just maintain his storage. I can do without. Okay. How are the monsters doing? Oh. Well, dang it. So the answer is... There's apparently a gap here. Okay, uh, let's take a look. Walls. Stone wall? Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna have to do that. Build those up here. At least the arrow towers are doing the trick. Okay, and we have two babies. I wonder how long it takes for a baby to grow up. Unsure. And yeah, how do I how do I collect the essence? Sitting around. Oh, it's probably because I'm just full up. Yeah. That's the issue. Is that I I just haven't been collecting enough essence. So in that case, maybe I should actually get an essence collector down at this point. I have no idea if that'll actually get me the essence or what exactly, but okay, do we have we do have more bad bad nicks coming. I'm gonna make that top priority. Okay, hopefully they'll stop coming around then. Okay, walls are being attacked. Monsters are about to attack your stone wall. Poke a hole in your defenses. Monsters will attack your walls in the main entry to the villages to congest congestion. Or congested. Building your perimeter walls thicker or by making your main entry to the village wider or shorter. Monster counts increase. Your maze will become increasingly more congested. Encouraging them to attack the walls. Make sure you're not making an excessively long tight maze. Give them some breathing room. I will continue to funnel, funnel into where you want them to. So they straight up want me to have mazing in this game. So maybe I should actually bust up the uh, the stone wall gate. I guess I'll keep that in mind. They do want me to Orcs Must Die. You know, this is actually one of the first games I've ever seen that has that as an option, and I really appreciate that. Okay, so... I'm just gonna get one of these right here. I have no idea what the range is. But hopefully it'll just pull in kind of general crystal, crystal essence for me to grab. Okay. So in that case, do we... Let me think on this one. First off, how do I pave? I don't see paving as an option. Oh, delete train, but on water. Makes sense. Yeah, I want to pave over that. So...
get two more work golems down. We got a little crystal. We should probably get that crystal mine down sooner than later. Crystal harvestry. I assume that means they'll just destroy the one interloping crystal. Okay. Let's makeshift well. Oh, can I upgrade this thing? And upgrade some of this stuff. I'll have to look back into that. Cause yeah, I love the uh, I love the idea of actually. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna dismantle the gate, and I'm just gonna make maze time. What I'm probably gonna do is just have a squiggly that enters here and just has a long, long line going back and forth the entire way down, lined with towers up and down both sides, and hopefully that won't that won't screw me over. Okay, defense towers. Looks like we might need regular other things to actually expand. Either that or the walls the walls are currently blocking my ability to build. Uh shoot. Alright. Yeah, so let's let's dismantle some of these things. Yeah, by the way, you might notice uh, some of the characters are named after you guys or subs or something like that. There is Twitch integration into this game. I honestly have no idea what the Twitch integration necessarily is, uh, but it it exists as a thing. Let's see. Yeah, maybe torches would help. It they would certainly light things up. Oh, also increase your build range a bit. And monsters won't attack it, so super useful. Yeah, so let's let's clear this out a little bit and work on the um Let's work on the wall maze. Harvesting no. Uh, balls. Really wish there was a way to, like, pin certain recipes. Okay, so we need, we need more builders. I don't even know what, oh, yeah, that's what half my people are working on. So, in that case, why don't we actually go... I don't currently need... I don't need a trasher. I kind of need a stone cutter. Don't need a smelter. I don't need a carpenter. So we're just going to go all in on building for a bit. We might end up needing more lumberjacks and some other stuff. We'll, we'll figure it out. Okay, how many dogs do I have? How how full is my my kennel? Eh, I got a little bit more space. And yeah, no workers, no workers, no workers, but that's fine. So I'm gonna put these two on last priority. They're getting completed, but what I really need to do is get these uh these walls started. Uh, let's see. So next order of business. Large fire bit. I'm going to put that on top. Oh. So these... These fire pits actually cost me building slots. Oh. Okay. 
Oh, can I... I can upgrade this. So we'll have to build some ancillaries, for sure. But yeah, just, just a couple loops here with some basic towers should be good enough. Uh, do we dismantle? Yeah, let's dismantle that one. And I'm not getting attacked from this side, so I'm going to dismantle this one as well. Okay, let's keep spitting those labor golems down. See any other essence? Some amounts. Well, there's a whole bunch sitting around around right there. Still is? What is this? Locks. Oh, there was a lockbox just sitting there. Okay. Uh that's something new. A shack for your keys. Where the heck do we make keys from? Gold ingot, iron ingot, gold coin sack. Okay. Manufacturing? Toolsmithy. Boost efficiency. Ooh. Okay, so this, this is something I'm going to want to work on. I'm going to get a little sick of listening to all those dogs barking, though. I... I hadn't really thought about that, but yeah, that that's actually going to bother me for a bit. Uh, let's see. I'll stay away from the gold coin sack. Initially. Oh, next question. Oh, wow, that... These fires are a fair bit better than I thought, so let's just dismantle that one. It's not even done yet. Okay, so we want to go back to Stonewall. Okay, dismantle those two. So we need that. Oh, requires kitchen. Okay, leaving that, leaving that for later. So yeah, when they when they say uh, the fire pit increases your your size by a bit, they were not kidding. It's a range generated sixteen. Unfortunately, it still counts as a structure. May maybe, maybe not. Oh. Maybe the zero means less building slots required. Let's try making um, a small a small fire pit. And see if it goes up at all. Okay, so I'm gonna make I'm gonna make this small fire pit top priority. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, so they do they do cost slots. What's the zero and the one mean? Yeah, I was hoping zero would mean reduced uh, building total requirement, but that's uh, not the case. I'm going to do that. Yeah, if you haven't noticed, walls block your build radius. Yeah, I'm quite aware. What are all my builders working on? I guess a lot of different things. Uh, let's see. Well, in this case, let's go back to walls, stone wall. I want to get that down there. Uh, 
the very least. And we're just going to protect via holy... Um, we're just going to protect everything via holy golems for, like, another night. But I'm, I'm really going to want to start building up here so I can push back a little bit against the corruption, which is probably going to piss off the corruption threat. I have no idea if you can actually destroy these. I'm assuming no. Okay, let's go back to Stonewall. Yeah, still can't do too much with that. Oh, the red X's along the edge of my screen mean they're, means they're taking damage. Okay. I understand. This actually, this actually does make a lot of sense. So let's, let's let them finish these couple of things, and then we'll go back up to building here. Uh, let's see, do we want to get... I'm going to get at least one more labor golem. Yeah, then we'll build up here. Hopefully this maze is more than thick enough for my people. Plunk that there. Luck fighting. Okay. So we want to do stone walls. Okay. Cancel these. So I can just get a bunch of extra essence by by hacking corpses to bits. Good to know. Unfortunately, I don't think it's quite... It's not quite efficient enough and my holy golem's going to go down pretty quick. If I can get... I can get a uh, fair bit off of that, actually. Alright, so I'll get that down a little bit closer to my defenses. Now, I'm wondering how walls block the, uh, the build auras. Because I might specifically want to cancel some of this. Well, one way or another... Learning is fun and interesting and time-consuming. Uh, let's see, can I grab any other aura up here? Nah, eh, not as much. I wonder if I could actually drop meteors on their buildings. It looks like the dogs get bar- uh, they get bitey. Oh, what? what my holy golems is just hanging out down there? Play about. It is definitely getting a little bit more aggressive around here, which is an issue. Dude, don't forget about the ancient Cullis Gate. Yeah, but do I get anything off of that? I see essence all around it, but it, I, I'm unsure if that actually is getting me extra essence. Monsters are a little bit more aggressive than I was hoping they would be. And there's a lot of them. Well, that's fine. Uh, let's see. So we want to... 
I mean, unfortunately, we mainly just want to... Oh, so we can't, we can't build this because... Frustrating. I wonder if I could actually... Build the fire pit here. Because it looks like buildings don't become less useful. Once I've got them down. Or, they don't become disabled when they're outside of my area. I just can't build any more there. So I might want to just daisy chain with fires. Or, I mean, honestly, I guess the other thing we can do is, if I go to civics, it's an ancillary require. It doesn't seem like ancillaries are actually terribly expensive. Well, th this seems to be working. It's a weird day. Actually, let's let's cancel that. Uh, let's get bow tower there. I want to put these ones closer to the wall, not farther away from it. Because, yeah, the, ma the maze is certainly working now. At least a fair bit better than it was earlier. Uh, let's see. If I put a fire pit right there, I bet, I bet that'll cover the whole thing and I can get rid of this regular fire pit. I should probably also consider making... Oh. I guess I don't need this. Never mind. I'm gonna put this to top priority. Because, yeah, if we can get bow towers just going up the sides, and they just maze right through and just... ambone them all down. And upgrade them up. Yeah! Yeah, so this is a little bit more tower defense than I was exactly expecting. And that's actually a huge positive for me. Uh, let's just get the labor golems. My my defenses are starting to get a fair bit better than they were. Close out of these things. We just not no. We've got plenty of lumber, so I'm not actually sure what's going on here. Okay, so why don't we? I'm gonna put one worker on the makeshift crystal harvestry. Just so we start actually grabbing that. Okay. Let's go back to defenses, towers, bow tower. We'll get that down there. Uh, let's see. We want to go back to walls. Why walls are not next to defenses, I have no idea. Do I want to... Hmm. Probably fine. And yeah, I know you can mouse over the collectors to gain essence. It's actually quite handy. I should probably get some more of these. They'll just keep filling me in. Yeah! And they'll tell me low energy, but that's fine. Yeah, that's, that's super helpful in and of itself. Okay. So, grand scheme of things, pretty happy with how stuff is going so far. 
We'll need to make another... Uh, let's see. So I'm, I'm going to cancel this. Might want to consider putting more people on st stone gathering, but... Doesn't seem necessary yet. And yeah, I just want to build this all the way right up here to start blocking the corruption. We... Supposedly there's something about magic? Convert material items and living tissue into essence when dropped inside? No. Oh, that makes crystals grow faster. Is there an easy way for me to push back against the... I, I haven't seen anything that specifically pushes back against the... my enemies. So do we want to get an armor smithy and a tool smithy down? At the very least, we want to get the tool smithy. Because I, I don't think I have one of those. Okay, so fire pits and anything that expands your build radius. We'll get rid of it as well. Good to know. Uh, looks like we need to upgrade the doggo house. Actually, no, we just need new new doggo house. Housing, doggo house. I'll just plonk another one down. Might also be getting to the point where we're going to need a uh, some kind of maintenance structure. Why are all of you dogs? Can 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 some of you guys not be dogs? Because that actually would be hugely useful for me. Let's see. Oh, we should probably go back to trashers. That I have no idea what that thing was. Corpse? Looks like it was probably a corpse. Corpses. Okay, so how are we doing on food? Food is doing fine. Crystal lithium, not so much so. Cooked meat, yeah. So eventually we're going to want to get into actual cooking. But this should be okay. See, do we have two dogs named Azriel? I have no idea. Uh, no? Yes, we have two Azriel dogs. Well, I don't know. I ain't questioning it. Let's see. I guess the other thing we might want to do is actually have this wall. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's keep doing walls for a bit. Uh, let's cancel that one. I'm just going to have that loop around just a little bit further. Seeing as it's already, like, that's really close to my my base at that point. So if anything gets there, they have to do a little bit of a circuit around my other towers. Probably could have made this a lot thinner, though. Oh, how am I going to reload it? You're right. I forgot that you actually have to reload the towers. Look, not used to that in other tower defense games, so... Bleh. But yeah, I can't... I could also do it myself. I forget. So we might as well get some more labor golems down. Oh, no, that's the well. There we go. 
We might want to actually get another one of these essence traps. So I'm going to grab... Probably right here. I mean, I could put it anywhere. I guess this I could actually trap. Just put it in some, like... Bumtown nowhere. And it would probably be okay. Okay, lighting, large fire pit. Do we start pushing back? Let's start pushing back. We don't want them going past a certain point. And what I'd like to do... Oh, yeah. They can make their own fire bow towers. Oh. Yeah, definitely want to just stop them here before they ex can expand to this direction too much. This area is doomed until we can figure out how to clear clear them out entirely. And even then, I'm not entirely sure if I'm capable of doing so. 